Hi, in this tutorial I'll show you how to fix we can't create a recovery drive on this PC. From start menu, search for CMD and run as administrator. Type recovery agent component space switch information. As you can see Windows recovery environment is disabled. Right click on this PC and select Manage. Under Storage, click Disk Management. My disk layout is MBR. That's mean the first partition holding the boot files and the recovery environment image. That's why you see around 600 megabytes. But if your disk layout is GPT, then you'll see two separate partitions one for EFI boot files and one for the recovery environment image. Anyways, right click on system partition, change drive letter and paths, click add, choose any letter, it doesn't matter, and click OK. Now my system partition labeled as E. Let's go back to command prompt, navigate to E partition, let's display the content for this partition by typing directory space switch all navigate to recovery windows recovery environment display the content winre.wim stands for windows recovery image this is the main file for recovering and resetting your PC and creating recovery drive as well if this file is missing or not compatible with your system, you'll definitely get a problem. Now let's correct our recovery environment component to point to this file by typing recovery agent component space switch set recovery image space switch path space type the complete destination to the Windows recovery image space switch target space usually it is the C letter assigned to the Windows partition and hit enter now let's enable our recovery environment component by typing RE agency space switch enable hit enter that's all to make sure everything is okay type recovery agent component space switch info enter as you can see, Windows Recovery Environment is enabled. Exit. Now you can remove Drive Letter. Right click on System Partition. Change Drive Letter. Click Remove. Yes. Yes. Now we can create Recovery Drive without any issue. One last thing, if you couldn't find Windows Recovery Image in your entire disk, you can get it from the Windows Installation Media, but it must be the same as your Windows Edition and version. Currently I do have Windows Installation Media as an ISO file. If I mount it, it will act as inserting Windows Installation DVD. Anyways, open Sources folder. Search for install.esd file. Right click it and open it with 7-zip application because it is an archive file. Go to Windows folder. Open System32 folder. Navigate to Recovery folder. There you are. Windows Recovery image is right there. You can simply drag and drop it wherever you want and do the same steps that I have did for pointing to this file. That's all. I hope it was easy to follow and helpful. Thanks for watching.